Hi dear students, welcome back to our English classes. Dear students, have you seen Tom and Jerry cartoon cartoons? Of course you are. In this cartoon, there are two animals. One is cat and another one is mouse. Just think, who is more clever in this cartoon? Of course, it is mouse. What do you know about mouse? Mouse we can see in our surrounding, in our home and our home backyard, forest areas, grassland areas, we can see the mouse. It is living under the soil and it eats grains. The next point, the mouse is a very small and intelligent creature. Then, the mouses are recognized as the vehicle of Lord Ganesha in Indian tradition. Mouse is the most used animal in scientific experiment. The mouse can swim easily in water. The cat is the mouse's biggest enemy. So, this is the small information about the rat or mouse. Dear student, here is a beautiful poem. The poem name is The Naughty Mouse. From this poem, the naughty mouse is living at poeter house. He is doing many activities at poeter home. Let's we know what are the activities he done at the house. Before that, we have to sing this poem once. Everyone look at the book and concentrate very carefully. The Naughty Mouse The Naughty Mouse in my house The Naughty Mouse in my house Has a very long tail Has a very long tail He walks around with he walks around without a sound. He walks around without a sound and eats a papa's meal. And eats a papa's meal. When papa comes away, he runs. When papa comes, he have a runs. A waving his long tail. Waving his long tail. Dear students, you also practice the poem to sing. Now I will explain this poem line by line. See the first stanza. The naughty mouse in my house has a very long tail. See, the mouse is very naughty. Naughty means someone who behaves badly. So, the mouse in this poem, the mouse is very naughty and he is living at the poeter home and he has a long tail dear student here the mouse is in gray color and we can see sometimes white color mouse also he has a long tail and long body little eyes and big ear see here i underline on the book mouse rhyming word is house mouse rhyming word is house Look at the second stanza. He walks around without a sound and eats a papa's meal. See, in this poem, the mouse walk around the house without making a sound. If the mouse make the sound, means someone will attack on the mouse. So, he is very intelligent. So, he is going making a without sound and eats papa's Papa's male means the rat is going to eat the papa's male. Male means a letter and it makes very tiny pieces of the paper. The paper is on the table. When papa comes to near the table, the mouse run away from the table and he hides somewhere by showing his long tail and it makes waving the 
long tail waving means moving from one side to another side he is easily escaped from the papas table dear student look at the second stanza around rhyming word is sound next the last line from the first line first stanza tail rhyming word is male comes rhyming word is goes runs rhyming word is buns so this is the small explanation about the naughty mouse dear students let's we know the question and answer the first question who is naughty option a mouse option b cat option c elephant the answer is mouse second question who eats papas mail cat naughty mouse monkey the answer is naughty mouse third question where does naughty mouse live house nest tree answer is house fourth one rhyming word of around male mouse sound the answer is sound let's begin the question and answers where does mouse live answer mouse lives in poet house who has a long tail answer naughty mouse has a long tail dear students hope you understand this poem you have to read and practice to sing the poem in a proper manner meet you in the next next class thanking you